Hi, this is Habib from Preston Audi, and this is the Audi A5 Coupe S line. This model has a 2 litre TDI engine with 190 PS and the slick S Tronic gearbox, delivering a sporty yet engaging drive. This model has had one previous owner. Starting at the front of the car, we have the S line enhanced exterior styling, including the aeronet grills, radiator grille, and front bumper, giving this a stylish front end. While as standard, we have the striking LED headlights, providing high quality illumination. Moving around the side, we have the stylish 18-inch 5-twin spoke star design alloy wheels, which look great, and complement the stunning brilliant black paintwork perfectly, while there's also S-line badges on the front wings, heated, electrically adjustable and folding body colour door mirrors with integrated LED side indicators, as well as aluminium sided door trim strips. While if we move around the back, we have LED rear lights with dynamic grey indicators, and as mentioned earlier, the S-line enhanced exterior styling also includes a roof edge spoiler, rear bumper and rear diffuser, giving this a stylish overall look. To access the boot, just hold down the button on the key, or use a soft release on the hatch. For a coupe, this has a surprisingly spacious boot, with 450 litres of space, so there's plenty of room to add your shopping or even a pushchair. While folding down the rear seats means you can add in those larger and longer items, such as flat pack furniture, or even golf clubs if you'd like. And once loaded everything, just pull down to close. Overall, this is a really stunning coupe that definitely stands out from the crowd, while it definitely looks the part in the stunning brilliant black paintwork. If we move inside, you'll see we have a spacious interior, with plenty of space for all passengers to sit comfortably. While accessing the rear seats couldn't be easier by folding either the front seats forward and then using the button to electrically slide the seat forward. Even though the rear seats are more suited to children and younger adults, it is surprisingly spacious in the back, while the plush leather and Alcantara upholstery really adds a high quality feel you expect from an Audi interior. There's also the added benefit of I6 points for the rear seats, so you can be reassured that your child seats will stay secure while on the move. And once you loaded everything in the back, just use the button to electrically slide the seat back and then pop it back into place. Now let's have a look at the interior from the driver's perspective. And what a stunning interior this is. In front of you there's a three spoke leather multifunction sports steering wheel with buttons to control the colour drive information system ahead as well as the infotainment display on the centre console. On the left hand side of the steering wheel we have these toggle switches which you can use to change the display ahead. We have general car information which can display speed consumption both short term and long term, as well as driver assist. There's also DAB, digital radio and media, telephone equipment for your connected device, as well as navigation. While if you find the interface too distracting, you can have the reduced display on black ink view, but if you click it again it will display the information. This model has loaded 14,924 miles, while as it was registered on the 28th of August 2018, its warranty is still valid until the 28th of August 2021, while it will also come with the original set of two keys. As standard, we have the 7-inch multimedia interface radio plus display screen. On the centre console, we have the MMI controller dial, which can be used to easily navigate through the system on the move without taking eyes off the road. We also have the toggle switches with preloaded shortcut menus, such as DAB, digital radio, media controls for your connected device with various sources such as Bluetooth and auxiliary, telephone equipment for your connected device, as well as navigation, and you can use the MMI controller dial to zoom in and out of the map. While we also have the smartphone interface, which allows you to connect your device media directly into the car via USB, and you can find the USB port underneath the armrest on the centre console. Moving down, we have the display for the Deluxe 3 Zone Electronic Climate Control, with type controls for the passenger, rear passengers and driver, with plenty of configurability to your liking. You can easily change the temperature, speed and direction on the move without taking your eyes off the road. While we also have the added benefit of heated front seats, which will come really handy, especially on those cold winter mornings. As standard, there's also Audi's Drive Select, which allows you to alter the driving dynamics by choosing one of the pre-configured modes. There's plenty of modes to choose from, such as Comfort and Auto, with the Dynamic being our personal favourite as it's the most driver-focused. Not only that, but we also have the Parking System Plus, adding front and rear parking sensors, which is a really great feature to have as it adds that extra reassurance when navigating through those tight spaces. There's also electrically adjustable leather and Alcantara upholstered front sports seats, which are really comfortable and supportive, especially on long journeys, while the matte brushed aluminium inlays really uplift the interior ambience. Overall, this is a really impressive interior, blending high quality materials and build quality with some great technology. This was the walk around of the Audi A5 Coupe S line. If you'd like to review viewing, test drive, or request a personalised finance quote, please contact us. Thank you for watching.